Somber sounds of bagpipes rang throughout the War Memorial Center this Veterans Day. It was just one of several events held across the area to honor those who have served. It's a day to thank the servicemen and women for all they've done to protect us of our freedoms. Sean Gallagher was at the War Memorial Center where a special group was on hand prepared to give back. After years of veterans protecting our freedoms, there's a group that's paying their respects to them. Nurses here pledging to take care of those veterans who need medical help here at home. A group of nurses from Marquette University are honoring veterans by placing a wreath outside of the eternal flame. But it's their work with the VA hospital paying the highest of respects. They want to dedicate their lives to the service of, of those who gave so much. And I just, I just get moved by the thought of what, what they do. The students in Marquette's program will work closely with veterans in need at the Zablocki VA Medical Center, and they're learning from the best. I can speak from a nurse side and a veteran yeah. coming back side. Tabitha Eden is a commander in the United States Navy, but she's also a nursing educator. Her experience in both fields is invaluable to these students. She can shed more light on those we are going to be serving. She's definitely an idol to me that she has both the world of the medical world as well as the veteran world. As important as their medical knowledge is, Tabitha also knows it's critical for these students to understand the personal side of taking care of these vets. It's incredibly important for nurses to have an understanding of um, veteran culture and veteran experiences. Nurses are who the veterans spend a majority of their time with. Sometimes there are some stories that are like, really hard to hear about, but it's very important to take that time and talk to them and learn these things. And, being with them as a whole another part of serving them. Students like Alexandra Goodrich making good on their promise to help the 350,000 veterans in Wisconsin. In Milwaukee, Sean Gallagher, today's TMJ4.